Year 7 Biology. Welcome. Are you excited for a fun learning session? Make sure you have your book and a pen before we start. Today you are going to learn about reproduction. Animal Sexual Reproduction. Sexual reproduction is a way of creating new organisms. Sexual reproduction requires two individuals to produce an organism of the same type. To create a new organism two cells are needed, one from the male and one from the female. These are called gametes, the male gamete is called a sperm cell, and the female gamete is called the egg cell. Fertilization is the process of a sperm cell entering an egg cell, and the nuclei of the two cells fusing. This fertilized cell can under the right conditions grow into a new organism. During internal fertilization sperm cells from the male partner are placed inside the body of the female partner. This type of fertilization is very common among mammals. During external fertilization the egg and sperm meet outside the bodies of both parents. The female parent typically lays her eggs, and the male fertilizes them. This type of fertilization is very common amongst fish. Often the parents of species that use external fertilization do not care for the eggs or the offspring, and this means that many of the eggs are eaten before the young can hatch or grow big enough to fend for themselves. This means that species that use external fertilization produce many eggs to be fertilized at one. For example a fish will weigh around 5 million eggs at a time. Species that use internal fertilization produce fewer eggs, for example cats on average produce around 5, this is because the eggs are more likely to be fertilized during internal fertilization. The animals that produce offspring in this way usually look after their babies until they are ready to survive alone.